Wednesday, January 23rd, 10.42 p.m. Yeah, it's 10.46. Like I said, 10.46 p.m. We return to headquarters. Dad, what a night. I'll never mix radish juice and carrot juice again. I hope the lake's warmed up a little this morning. <sighs> Ten, nine, eight. <sighs> wow, the hole seems long this morning. Three, two, one, fire! the top of this. Hey, who plugged up the hole? Why, the, why the sun ain't even out yet. No wonder I'm so sleep. Yikes! What was that? Oh. Well, ask a silly question. sent for you, Dodgers, because we are facing a crisis. The world supply of Alludium Fosdex, the shaving cream atom, is alarmingly low. Now, we have reason to believe that the only remaining source is on Planet X, somewhere in this area. And you want me to find Planet X? Is that it? Can you do it, Dodgers? Oh, in the boobly boobly, sir. Because there's no one knows his way around outer space like Duck Dodgers in the 24th and a half century! <laughs> uh, pardon me, Doc, but could you rent me a U dry flying saucer? I've got to get back to the Earth. The Earth? Oh, the Earth will be gone in just a few seconds. Oh, well, uh, don't bother, then. No point in wasting money on a flying saucer when the ice's not gonna... Uh, pardon me again, Doc, but uh, just what did you mean by that crack about the Earth being gone? Oh, uh, I'm going to blow it up. It obstructs my view of Venus. It does? That's a shame. <laughs> Where's the kaboom? There was supposed to be an earth-shattering kaboom. we shall pursue to find Planet X. Starting from where we are, we go 33,600 turbo miles due up. Then west in an astro arc deviation to here. Then following the great circle, seven radio lubes south by down east. By astro astrobo to here, here, and here. Then by space navigo compass to here, here, and then to here, and here. By 13 point strato cumulus bearing four million light years and thus to our destination. Now, do you know how to reach Planet X? Uh, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, oh, sure. Well, I wish you'd explain it to me sometime, Buster. Uh, well, 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 it's very simple, sir. If we follow uh, the, uh, those planets, we can't very well miss Planet X. <laughs> oh, that's ridiculous. <laughs> of all the stupid suggestions. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. I think I've got it. 
I'll just bet that if we follow those planets, we'll find Planet X. Chad, how do I do it? I uh, don't know. Capture that creature and return the Illudium Pu-36 explosive space modulator. in the name of Mars. Mm, isn't that lovely? Mm. Look, bud, I've got news for you. I have already claimed this bit of dirt for the Earth, and there just ain't room enough on this planet for the two of us. I do believe you are right. <laughs> Little does he realize that I have on my disintegration-proof vest. <laughs> you may fire when ready, Grizzly. <laughs> You had a butt in. Well, get back in that spaceship. Uh, y y y yes, sir, your hero ship. Yes, sir. Ha-ha! <laughs> Cause the drop on you was my disintegrating pistol. And brother, when it disintegrates, it disintegrates. <laughs> well, what do you know? It's disintegrated. <laughs> I'll send him an ultimatum. a little stinker is up to on my super video detecto set. <laughs> one oh seven. He left the blast in. One oh eight. We arrived at the blast in. Our deductions later proved that we had missed him by one minute. One oh nine. We set out in pursuit. We lost him in a large smog bank over Los Angeles. Oh dear, now I shall have to create more Martians. Hey! This Martian hot rod better get at least a million miles to the gallon. The only thing just across the street. My Illudium Q36 explosive space modulator. Well, back to the old drawing board. <laughs> Boy, it's really wonderful to be back in civilization. in Martians.
Buster. This planet ain't big enough for the two of us, so off you go. And now, this planet is hereby claimed for the Earth in the name of Duck Dodgers in the 24th and a half century. Yeah, but it's a big deal.